Oh, welcome to another edition of What the Fuck, Happenings in YouTube, Atheist Community, and Stick and Fun. And yes, we've all become terribly redundant and boring. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's sort of the theme. Yeah, we, I, I don't know, we sort of jumped the shark, I suppose. Vapping now. I should they call this vapping. Mm. You know, doing the vapor smoking. Uh, it doesn't sound too good, so I'm going to come up with some other name for it. But anyway, um, good stuff. <laughs> Except I'm, you know, I'm just, this is like my best friend now. It's just, it's, it's a good best friend now. It's pretty good. <laughs> you know, it's best friend, you can take it apart, put it in your pocket. It's okay. Pretty good best friend. Um, but anyway, um, yeah. I don't know. It's a thing of concepts. But no, won't go there. Uh, but anyway, um, yeah, I stick him last night. We'll do that first, I guess. Um, yeah, it was good. It was social, you know, and that you know, I don't. It's not that I hate socializing, especially you know, with some new women, good women, <laughs> really good women, and uh, so you know, it's good. But it's like it's losing its character from its original theme, and um, but I suppose that's okay, you know. Now and then you you know do something different, you know, eat potatoes one day and then you have some other thing the next day, kind of thing. You gotta mix it up a little bit, so that might work out. Um, but there is kind of this, this malaise, <laughs> using a Jimmy Carter term, that, uh, you know, it just might be from the perspective of people in this corner of YouTube. Um, you know, we just kind of lost the old drama, and, um, you know, it's, yeah, it's just kind of, you know, some of the old characters are gone, and the new characters just don't have the, um, they're just not as good at you know, pulling at you, or maybe it's just that you get used to it all, you know, I mean, after three years, I'm almost at my third year now, you know, the anniversary's like in two weeks, I think, and maybe that's just it, it's like you go through this, this process, you know, maybe it's like learning how to, I don't know, like, like first relationships, and there's always all this stuff, and it's all this, you know, and then you look back at that, you know, three years later, and you say, geez, what the hell was I so upset about, um, you know, and maybe it's some of that happening, um, yeah, it's just a weird, you know, the medium's maturing, so to speak. Um, <laughs> the enemy's getting more obvious, I think. Uh, the idea that there has to be something better than this, and somehow we have to work towards that, you know, something better than corporate ownership um, and all that crap. So, I mean, it's good we got channels for that now, the anti-broadcast channel, and, you know, it's plugging along. But, you know, it's, it's hard to get any real passion for stuff. It's hard to even know the character of the people we're talking to. I mean, it really would be interesting just to see um, what it is. You know, is it a bunch of 14-year-old jackasses? I mean, what the hell is it? Who the hell am I talking to? I mean, you, you know there's a good number of, you know, you got a dozen or two dozen or three dozen people that get it or something, and then, you know, but is that it? I mean, is the reach any further than that? Um, but anyway, it's this is just all, you know, just sort of got provoked a little bit last night. Um, yeah, I think Karina said something like, yeah, you all suck or something. Like, all the videos at least suck. She said a lot of things last night, but I'm not allowed to mention them. And, uh, but, <laughs> yeah, she was pretty funny. Um, so, but anyway, yeah, it was a good night last night. It was, like I said, we talked about movies for like three hours, which is really, you know, what a big waste of time that is. But, you know, like I said, you have to... Um, I, you know, I don't know what to say. It's just, it's not my it's not my strong point thinking of myself as a social person. But you know, obviously, I'm not really very human focused, and um, you know, but whatever. So uh, yeah, I can't really report much else. This thanks to the usuals. There's, you know, lots of people that are there every week. You know, Herm Girl and Matilla, and I mean, just a whole bunch of people, and I really appreciate them. You know, being around and the uh, comments and such, even if they're not on camera and whatever. And, I mean, whatever. I mean, still, there's still people showing up, so I'll keep doing it. But, yeah, I mean, you know, i gotta, <laughs> I got to plan some entertainment. <laughs> I gotta, maybe I can hire a clown, you know, to come in and, you know, do some card tricks or something. I don't know. Uh, so, anyway, party favors, little shooty things. I don't know. Summer, you know, summer. <laughs> so, you know, who knows what can happen in the summer. All kinds of hanky panky. Yeah. Anyway, um, uh, so where do we go from there? Uh, people making videos. Yeah, there's not a whole lot. Um, oh, oh, drama flipper guy. Um, 
you know, he's doing what the fuck's now, which is good. I mean, he calls him like, what, the biscuit or something. I don't know, some kind of <laughs> silly English thing. Um, and then, you know, it's good because, you know, I like watching those kind of videos. I just, you know, obviously I'm not too good at making them anymore. Um, but part of it is my so the subscription list keep getting blown up, you know. I mean, it's, you know, I was, uh, you know, I used the website and then YouTube broke its, those, whatever it is they called that, where they gave you a little hunk of somebody's videos that you could get from their programming thing. And it was really pretty good. And they just, just I don't know, I guess they're going to discontinue it because they're not updating it and fixing it. So it's no good anymore. So all the work I did on the website with that is for nothing. Um, but I was using that, you know, to see who's making videos and to watch my videos. And then, you know, when that broke, I set up a good subscription list on the Do Not God channel. And, uh, you know, so that's gone. So that's kind of a bitch. And so it's just such a hassle to keep going to me. i got to go do it on some other one of my channels and try to get everybody I want in there. Um, you know, the ones you really got to know whether they made a video. And then there's the list of people that, you know, you want to know, but you don't got to know. Um... But, you know, it's all, everything's time consuming, and uh, so I just, I have so many little projects I'm working on that I just, yeah, I really feel so pressed for time. Um, you know, so, I, I mean, that's a good thing, is, you know, it's, it might be boring on YouTube, but it, for me, it's, you know, there's a lot to do. There's a lot of things I'm interested in working on, so it's not like I'm bored. Um, and, yeah, I've made plenty of videos this week, ton of them. Uh, I had a little argument with Maddox the Pirate over the economy. Got to do a couple more response videos to a couple of the idiots out there who made videos. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, the philosophy stuff's moving along. Uh, that one and all guy, he's sort of getting into the conversation, so I'll, I'll talk to him a bit. And, you know, the conversations with conference reports have been really good. Um, weirdly, I mean, Nick the Modern Mystic's actually commented on a few of my videos which I didn't even think he was watching anymore. So that was sort of interesting. So maybe he'll he'll make a little philosophy video now and then. Um, so anyway, uh, what else is there? Uh, yeah, but like I said, the, there's just weak, the drama's all kind of weak. But that, you know, I sort of like not having a drama. I mean, I, I'm really not a whore for that stuff. Um, but at the same time, you do need something. You need some sort of passionate argument stuff going on of some kind. And it just... You know, even though the Max the Pirate thing generates some some heat, so to speak, it's it's kind of lame heat because it's just so it's so black and white. I mean, that, that's you know the, the you know calling taxing inheritance you know stealing, <laughs> you know, is you know if that's going to be the rhetoric you're fighting, I mean, there's really no fight there. I mean, somebody can't figure out that people who inherit stuff didn't earn it. I mean, if they're going to use the word earn, money you earned. When you inherited it, I mean that's just that's just so bogus a premise that just no. But you're gonna how, what's the even point of arguing with somebody that fucking close-minded? Not even close-minded, just so capable of distorting the truth. Um, and that to me is almost like it's it's like when I have arguments with these people about the legal issues. I did a whole series of videos about Remy. Um, because he did a couple of videos, which I'm glad he did, just because I wanted to be able to expose exactly. Uh, you know, why he's full of shit, um, you know, and, and because he has a definite prejudice that he comes to it with, and he's looking, you know, when people are going to look for something, they can manufacture it, and it's, you know, that's just the way it is, so anyway, this isn't very what the fucky, <laughs> I mean, I'm just talking about stuff I should be making videos about, so anyway, Miss Pac-Man made a, a good video, so Miss Pac-Man is right over here, <laughs> she is so, just such a lovely face, um, you know, the rest of it was good too, but you know the faces. Uh, Jedi, you know Jedi Master Boo Boo. I did want to mention her just because I see her. You know, I'll see some crappy video, and then I'll see her little name in the comments, and she, you know, she has the tenacity to argue with these assholes, and I really admire that. Because I don't, I don't, I don't know how people have the patience for that crap. Uh, I don't know how useful it is either, but I mean, it's it's you know, so you used to see anti bullshit man. You used to see his name a lot. He'd argue with people, but I haven't seen his name much. But, you know, people got a life to live and all that kind of stuff. Um, but, yeah, you know, I mean, I do, I, I do notice people who do out there fighting the fight. So it's not like you're doing it for nothing, because at least I notice it, and I appreciate that you'll sit there and argue with these assholes. So, let's see. Oh, uh, vloggerheads. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually running for king of vloggerheads. <laughs> yeah, 
and it's you know really only, it's just because it's sort of a sample site. I mean, I really don't like the whole concept of owners, you know. And Renetto owns the site, and so if it ever did take off, you know, that he's just going to capitalize on that. But um, I just like the, the fact that there's sort of an opportunity there to try to mess around with. You, you don't you don't have any tools really. You're gonna, I'm going to have to make external ones to make the site do anything new or innovative, but. It's just the idea of setting up some sort of infrastructure about the trolling and about how you deal with conflict with people and the constitution, so to speak, and a democracy and all those kind of ideas. So it is a little bit of a, a playground for um, experimentation. I mean, it is a little bit of an island where you can go out and do some of these experiments. I sort of like that argument, the island argument, you know, because that, that comes up a lot. Of, I mean, I know I made videos no, too late. Uh, you know, the idea of just having anarchy island and letting the anarchists eat each other. But I'd like to see what atheist island looks like, because I'm not sure atheists are all that charming.